So, what are we going to make? A ball. We're going to make a ball out of milk. Is that cool? Yeah. So, it, the experiment said plastic milk, but really it's casein, which is kind of a cheese type thing. But what we're going to do first, we've got a cup of milk. We're going to stick it in the microwave and heat it up so it's hot, but not boiling. And then we'll come back. So, we just heated up our milk for about a minute and a half. It's hot, but it didn't boil. Okay, We're going to pour it in here, and then how many teaspoons are we going to put in of vinegar? Do you remember? Four. Four teaspoons of vinegar. And then we're going to stir it around, and we're going to see what happens. So, here's our milk. this and film? Yep. Good. Maybe you want to smell? Ugh. Oh, it's vinegar! I like the smell of vinegar. So we're doing four teaspoons of vinegar. How many is that? <laughs> Two. Two. Three. Three. I can already see the blobs forming. Four. Look at those weird looking bomb blobs. Okay, how about I film for a second and you stir it. Okay. So we're just stirring up our milk and casein, or milk and vinegar. And then we're going to put it through a sieve and see what we get. Oh, did you want to put food coloring in it? What color? Um, red. You want red? Mm -hmm. Oh, wow, look at that, Tor. Okay, let's put some red food coloring in. Stir. Mm. Now we'll have a red plastic ball. Maybe. Look at that. Hmm. That's pretty interesting. Okay, I think we're good. Alright, so let me go get the strainer and then we will put this over the sink and we'll strain it. But there's little tiny holes that will sink out. Well, uh, the stuff here won't. But let's see. Alright, so we put the vinegar in our hot milk and we got these stuff, chunky things. Is, is this stuff? And now we're going to pour ball. it into a strainer. Yeah, so those big chunks, that's what we're going to form into a ball. So we're straining away all the rest of the liquid. We're going to get this stuff out. Because that's what's going to form our ball. There we go. And look at those chunks down there, dude. So that's called casein. Basically, the vinegar made all the proteins come together in the milk. And now, what we can do is we can squish all that stuff together into a ball, and then we have to let it dry out a little bit, but then we'll get plastic milk. Should we try it? Mm-hmm. Okay. So, it's going to be a new red ball for me. Yeah. We just squoze all the water out and formed it into kind of a ball. And now we're just going to stick it back in that same bowl and let it dry out for a couple of days and let's see what happens. Should we do that? Okay. So, here's the ball in our bowl. And now we're going to let it dry out. Smell my hand. What does it smell like? Alright, 
So, here's our milk and vinegar experiment. So we put some vinegar in hot milk and it took all the proteins and put them all together and it made casein and what does it feel like, Torn? Does it feel like plastic? Plastic soap. Plastic what? Plastic soap. Yeah. Is it hard? Kind of hard. Is it a little squishy? Mm -hmm. Does it bounce? Let's see. Oh, it bounces a little bit, huh? Let's see. Let's see it from room. Oh, here, come over in here. And we'll do it in the kitchen. Well, it's not a very good bouncy ball, but it's kind of hard, huh? Yeah. What do you think? Is that a cool experiment? Uh -huh. Yeah. Whoa.